Hello everyone, it's Dating Dreamer and I'm back and this is September 19th, Monday and yeah, uh, remember I say I may not want to do this kind of bus tube uh, update anymore but it has been bothering me um, try not to uh, not try not to just not to do this because I still um, want to show you um, my progress and uh, how's everything going here. Um, so I'm thinking, actually, I have a lot of progress from June to this month. A lot. <laughs> it, I just feel stressed out uh, just thinking uh, if I show all the things at once. So uh, that's why I, I, I was thinking, ah, you know, um, I stopped being busy recently and uh, showing that many progress is kind of difficult, difficult to me. You know, just in here and think about everything. Uh, that's why I said, um, maybe I stopped doing it for a while. Um, maybe not doing it again, but. I don't know, I still want to talk to everybody. So today I have an idea. Why if I do this? Probably may not be a good idea for me. But why if I do this weekly? And because now I don't have as much time as um I I have before to stitch. So uh I Maybe able to do um just stitch only few projects in a week. So I'm I'm thinking changing this into weekly will be uh something that will be easier to me. Maybe and you may think, Jean, are you sure? <laughs> you may stop doing this um you no know, like uh, just a couple weeks and. I don't know, I don't know. Uh, we will see, okay? <laughs> just even though... I feel I can do, do it sometimes. I don't know. <laughs> I still want to show you everything I um, stitch. So, my craft thing. Okay, uh, let's get into... Let's get into uh, my progress of... Um, this week, past week, um, <laughs> this week, okay, and the first one is always along the river. I haven't uh, progressed to this one, especially recently. Yeah. Oh, yes, let me see how to show you. Okay, so um, well, um, yeah, this area is where I where my new progress at <laughs> um, the ascension above these people. I I stitched this tree just here. To here and I realize I don't really like working on the trees in this project because um it's probably the um, only confetti place of this project. Says uh I will not know where my stitch should go, but it's still fun. I just. I don't know, I like stage buildings more. So and I like this little pink tree. It's like a um, cherry blossom <laughs> but I, I'm not sure if it's that. Uh, yeah. And you can see these people actually on the boat. And I got a, a advice so uh, uh yeah from 
one of my stitch friends said um, maybe I can show the detail of this progress sometimes and actually I never think about this I never thought about this yeah actually I can do it sometimes and I'm thinking what uh, how to do it like uh, so this is all the stitch I have done this one actually it's a uh, already a big piece but <laughs> mm. this project it's like this project is this long and uh, we are still here <laughs> yeah I can show you the details sometimes and uh, just record a video maybe take a few pictures I'm still thinking how to do that and another piece I worked on is Castle Cutway by Art C it's um extra large version so I stitch it on 40, 40 count linen 2 over 2 10 stitch and it's still so big actually recently I have been working on this a lot but it's still uh, just a little corner but it's so pretty it's super pretty and very detailed and I have been working on this sky I will just keep going the sky roll the first row will be hmm will be easy because uh, the sky is, has not many not many colors but when I get to the second row you will be the real challenge because we will stop in confetti and an entire piece <laughs> and half piece uh, actually I'm expecting to do that because I love uh, this kind of challenge and yeah you can see everything that looks so great looks so great and I like these people flags this is awesome And speak of full coverage, I have bought several patterns from Heavenless Design and Artsy. I love these two brands. Um, I haven't shown you those patterns I bought yet. I'm thinking make another video to show you my full coverage, new plan, new purchase, and a uh, new wish list. Yeah, I have updated my wish list, and I found many patterns I really like to I will slowly get it <laughs> another full coverage I've worked on this week is this one Miklos Harbor also by RC this is a small piece because I stitch it on 28 count Lugana I love this fabric so much still working on the first page this is so pretty and this part is a, has a lot of confetti because look at it so many colors just in here and then it will have a bunch of white color and I was worried about that uh, you can see the grid line very clearly under the white area but actually it looks kind of looks fine right yeah because I was really wor worried about that but now uh, I think it looks fine <laughs> This is a, one of my favorite, and I spend pretty much time 
um, the simplest by Cruel Design Studio. The, this one is summer simple. Yeah, I did work on a little bit on this one. <clears throat> I do I did a little bit more in this um, you can see scenery this is a beach and this line also the tomato world <laughs> I love this one and compared to compared to um, another simple cruelty side simple this one is um much easier <laughs> i say much easier it just has a lot of backstage but i love this one because everything about summer what can i say <laughs> this is what i love and this fabric is 14 count beadless oatmeal in case I pronounce it wrong. Yeah, I stitch it with three strands as as the uh, instructions say. I'm afraid to change anything on the instruction because I don't want to make any mistake, especially Kuro decides to use a pattern. So I just follow what I recommend. <laughs> so this thing, I still have my needle on because I'm still working on this one. And let's yeah, the other day we also stitched this Chinese letter together. This is Asian sampler. Also by Kuro Design Studio. I already tell you how hard this project is to me. But I have fun um, with this part because it just a uh, full stitch and a back stitch. <clears throat> but this, this, this is really, I don't know. <laughs> It's really uh, took me a lot of energy to do that, <laughs> but this is a lovely piece. I love working on it, mm, but just some part that I um, I feel wow, this is really difficult, very really difficult. Also, it used a more technique than other all oh, my other projects because that has uh, so many different technique, and so I I really I really admire the designers so much because they always have so many ideas, different ideas, and put it into the cross stitch design. Yeah. So they are really awesome, like I said. And last time we stitched this first Chinese character, and then I work on, I finish other two characters. Looks so great. This is really really great. It's like a, um, this font is like um. If you have seen the Chinese, uh, how to say it? Um, <laughs> let me think how to describe it in English. Have you seen the the? It's like a, a traditional. Oh, I can use the traditional Chinese a Chinese font, you know, with ink and uh, like a. Uh, brush, the kind of pen. This is absolutely beautiful. 
Okay, and last project I worked on this week is the preprint project by Join Something. Let me get it out. Mediterranean style. <laughs> it looks just a little corner, but uh, yeah, so pretty. I love the colors. I, should, I start enjoying a layer preprint. Layer preprint kits more. Yes. Because uh, I always feel the fabric is so stiff and uh, it hurts my fingers, but I feel like I'm getting used to it. So I start working on it more. I think my progress just um, make this area bigger. <laughs> yeah, I stitch like here, also a little bit this place. You can see some stitch down here. So that's all my progress this week, just this week. And I was slowly showing you um, what I have done in past three, three months, four months, <laughs> three and a half months, because that's a lot and uh, it's so hard for me to show all them at once so i was slowly showing you and i also just ordered a few patterns on one to three stage two halloween patterns one of them out of stock so i'm still waiting for them to arrive i'm so excited so i guess let's oh <laughs> hope you enjoyed this video and have a wonderful day have a wonderful time stitching I will see you next week. I promised really. <laughs> okay, so see you next time. Bye.